Hello, welcome back to Spaceborn. My name is Usser. I hadn't planned on playing too many more of those, but my last video got so many views that I don't really have a choice. I've got to play some more. So we're going to talk to Ukra. I did some grinding. I've been trying to spread it out pretty easy, evenly, but I did max out the Misk Tool Booster. I don't know what any of the other ones were. Ooh, more cargo. Rapidly recharges ship's energy. That's cool. I like that. Ooh, gains experience. That's even better. I have damage modification, damage protection I haven't done much with. I also outfitted my ship with all kinds of mods. Uh, all the offense, defense, and just random ones are completely filled up. Okay. I didn't think we would make it, but here we are. What now? I also had doubts, but congratulations. You did a great job. Now we wait for Soy. She may arrive at any moment. Our part of the mutual agreement was your treatment, right? Yeah. You're gonna take me to the capital and deliver me to a Nego Health Center. Can't do that no matter what capital. What are we going to do? We're at an Arbuck station. I think you better go around and make friends. Try to help out people around here who may need things. I'm on a roam, but remember that I don't have much time left. I'll be around if you need me. Try making. I. Wait a minute. I never completed the escape plan with this. So I've got a mission to meet Anka. I I had an issue with the game where I couldn't find my stealth module and I tried loading an earlier save and going through some of this and I know why I couldn't do my stealth module now. It's a consumable. Did not realize that. You get one mission out of it and it's gone and I haven't found another one, which I'm not I'm not that happy about. Like it'd be fine if I could go buy more. But I actually really enjoy doing the stealth, and I can't do anything about it. Okay, so I finally got that mission. I know I have talked to Anka before. I know I did. Like I said, I, I loaded an earlier save because I didn't understand where my stealth module went. Now I know. And you can't buy another one. You just can't. So we're going to try doing this wingman for rent. I also have a bounty mission because it said danger level 6. However, when you look at this, that means it's a level 12 mission. Uh, that's wonky. I don't understand that. Don't don't give me a danger level rating and then not have it the same as my level. That just does not make any sense. I mean, I don't know if it even scales at a 2 to 1 ratio. It's just weird. Um... One of the things I found. Okay. That's new. Um, somebody's under attack by pirates, and that's that's never popped up before in all my my. Okay, I, I actually want to find out where that is because I want to help them. Because that's completely new. So we're gonna do that first. Um, while I was wandering around doing stuff, I scanned the system and I found Space Anomaly, which is like this giant asteroid with a bunch of holes you can fly into. And in the center, center there's a core of the asteroid, and if you harvest that like you would in mining, it's like worth 14,000 bucks. It's incredible. Uh, hi there, guys. Holy smokes! Well, I could use the experience, I could use the money, so we're gonna do it. I also found a, a wrecked ship with my scanner that allows you to salvage it. It's kinda like mining an asteroid, but you get like cast off ship parts that you can either sell or use for uh, uh, crafting, which I can't wait till they get to the crafting part. We haven't done any crafting. Woo! Ah. So I've got new turrets, I've got new lasers, I've got new missiles. You don't get to buy um, a shield generator. All you can do is get those mods. So like my shields have not improved. 
I did get some mods that improve it, but it's a small, like, a 3% improvement. And I'm used to, like, Freelancer where you can buy a new shield generator. Hey, he went through the ship. That's cheating. I can't just fly through a spaceship like that. Cheater. Man, I don't know what you got on this big cargo ship, dude, but you pissed a lot of people off. Gotcha. All right, we got two more. Where'd he go? Where? Where? There he is. He's shooting at me! Oh my god, why would a pirate do that? Okay. So I protected him. Uh, I guess they're all gone. We're eternally grateful. Please accept this payment. Okay, thanks for the money. Thanks. So that's never happened before. That reminds me a lot of, like, a rebel... Um... Galaxy or Rebel Galaxy Outlaw where you just have those random things that you could come across. I've never seen that and I've I've hopped around the system quite a bit actually and Oops, let's get outside my ship so I can see where the other stuff's at. So we got one over here to open We got one up there up Drone get it Yeah, okay we do have some more. Open. Oh, that's going to hit all those because they're all close enough. Cool. And then we just wait for my drone to bring me back my ship. Drones are awesome. I have to say, they're really cool. Um, you get experience for them mining asteroids. Amazing. That's awesome. Also, how's my level doing oh i'm a level 10 i have a skill point um let's go attack i probably should have done experience just so i gain a level quicker i'll do that next time okay yeah 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 i protected them let's go on and do our mission now which i should be better set up for our mission since i am now a level 10 warp drive charging in three that was cool. One. I like how they make it. I, I wish you'd see it a little bit more. Somewhere in between what I've seen so far in Spaceboard and Rebel Galaxy, because in Rebel Galaxy it was non-stop people asking for your help, and you're like, I'm, I'm trying to get from point A to point B. I'm just trying to do something here. Leave me alone. But in this one, I hadn't seen it until now. So... All right. When you hit a jump gate on the edge of a country, you see you can jump to any system whatsoever. So to get into the XK1s, I would have to go to one of these border systems, and then once I do that, I can jump to any of the XK planets. It's actually really cool. Jumping to I cannot center. wait, because I read it in the scene description of when I get to build my own country. Because I'm building a faction. I don't care if these people like it. I'll steal their planets from them. Okay. Hey, they'll be here any time now. Come over and get in position. Staying away won't do you any good. Where the hell are you? Hold on. Um. Let's warp there. I was gonna say, st staying in position won't do you any good. Fuck you I'm gonna come out of hyperspace right on top of them, aren't I? Okay, so Anka, what type of ship do you have? I don't know. But we've got two level 10s here. What's up, man? How's it going? I'm here. I've got them on my radar. I see seven ships. Okay. 
seven ships is not a big deal. Enemy detected. As long as they're uh, not too tough. Ay, 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 he flew right through me. Nah, they're fine. Keep Arbus under heavy fire. Help him out. Shut up! I am! I just killed one of the seven! Oh, this music is so good! Ow, somebody shot me. Where did my radar go? It's it's gone. I couldn't have taken that much damage. Come with me. You wait for a bit and fix your ship. Once we find the right spot, I will send you the coordinates. Okay then, I'll wait for you to get in touch. Okay, drone. Let's call my drone out. I didn't think I took much damage, but go ahead and repair me. I love that the drone can do that. Um, I'm not telling him to gather. I don't, I haven't messed with that too much. I'm assuming gather means he's going to go out and get all of the goodies. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Hold on. Yeah, he's just gonna pick up everything. So I don't mess with the drone as much as I probably should, especially with the, the abilities down here. Damn. This doesn't look right. I'm sending you the coordinates. Get over here, quickly. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> yeah, as soon as my drone gets back, I'll be right there. But loot. Where's he going? Is he coming back to me? Oh, no, he's got one more. I haven't bought a new drone yet. They're expensive. Take all. Oh, that, that looks like a good turret. That's at least going to be worth some good money. Turret Ignition T4. I didn't even see the purple one. Ooh. Okay. Get back into the cockpit, because as soon as I get there, it's probably going to be death and destruction time. One. How many of these do I have to go to, by the way? How many spots are there? Also, they gave me some slave nets. I have never had it where... Oh, now see, this might be... A... Oh, I guess it's not a salvage area. Okay. So... This is what a salvage area looks like, though. You have all that stuff, and you just go salvage it, and it slowly, like, each piece slowly disappears as you break it down. You'll get burned wire. You actually get some parts that are usable. Uh-oh, hey, look! Those are those things, and I can't remember their names. They're hiding. It's an ambush. I can feel it. Fleas! If That's... we try to go through there all together, we won't make it. I am leading to clear the ambushers. You provide me long-distance support. Really? Okay, let's go to the ambush point. You guys just, like, try and snipe them. I'll just take care of everything. How's that Careful. sound? Just Enemy as I expected. Detected. Come on, Naklov, Rive. Let's help them from afar. Set all your weapons to long range and attack with everything that you've got. Yeah, take that. Okay, I'm gonna have to get outside of my ship because these little bastards, they just kind of fly around in circles and shit. Aha! Looks clear. They're inside that wreckage. I can see them. Move over there. Oh, hold on. I will. I promise. I will. But, take all. Return. Let's 
says repair. Oh, my shield's down. So let's wait for my shield to slowly build back up. Or I could just have the droid take care of it. Way to go, Mr. Drone. All right, let's go spring their ambush. Those things do hit your shields pretty damn hard. Now, do I have to get to that actual point? Because I kind of missed my entrance. Whee! In we go. Enemy detected. Yeah. Except I'm getting out because they were inside, and that's. Ah. Uh, Their trap has failed. Everyone, to the wreckage. Let's team up. Take all, what is that? Erdan rocket, whoa! Whoa! Awesome! That did some damage. Okay, see, I know I bought a better rocket and I saved it afterwards, but it's not showing me that I did. It's not showing the rockets that I got, and it's not showing the defensive stuff. Now, I know I saved it afterwards, but it's not showing up the stuff that I did actually get. That's a little disappointing. But I got a super rocket. I got a new turret. I don't know what it is, but... Deal with the ambush. Like, I thought I did. I thought I'd finished it. Enemy detected. Boom! Take that! These guys are really bad! Great. I can feel it. We're getting closer to Tian. Keep moving in that same direction. Mm -mm. Nagcloth, grind. Come with me. You wait for a bit and fix your ship. Once we find the right spot, I will send you the coordinates. I mean, that's what I'm doing. Salvage the loot and fix your ship. Yeah, I am. Where? Droid? Where the hell are you? He's not out here. Okay, open. Whatever. He didn't come out. Okay, go to Tyon's location. I'll do that. Okay, I'm Enemy three quarters of the way to my level. We're getting out of here. What? No, they just showed up. Shut up. Whoa. Hey, escape the battlefield. Okay. Oh my God, that guy wasn't even getting damaged. How do I, how do I escape the battlefield? Oh, I gotta go to that mission point. 
Keep the dodging going. That looked like a missile that just went streaming by. See, this music I'm not as big on. Just not my cup of tea. The metal, it's so perfect for this kind of crazy ass shit. Oh, is that Zan again? They're... I don't know if they're trying to hit us or if they're trying to shoot the shit out of that thing. Uh... Was that Anka? That wasn't Anka. That was, like, one of his wingmen, right? There's a loud explosion and I don't know why. I don't know if it was supposed to be for that guy who went spiraling out of control. I'm assuming so. The timing was a bit off. Okay, meet him at the A1 station. So, we did it. We succeeded in our mission. Got some cool shit. Before I even talk to him, I'm installing that stuff. Holy cow. A purple one? I've seen it for sale and they can be obscene prices like as much as a ship 150,000 for one so I don't know if I got one quite that good I hope so I would love that didn't get my level I also need to show off just the random missions you can pick up and uh, I'm going to guess that I remember the key to do it, but it's kind of cool. You have freelance missions, which is kind of like the escort, capture stuff, they'll send you to kill um, stations. You have trader missions, which they just want you to collect certain things, or take them from point A to point B. And then you have pirate missions. Obviously, you go out and do piracy. You can piss off some of the countries quite a bit that way. Well, I guess I gotta talk to him. I did my part. Yes, you really did a great job, thank you. This can't be over, we need to locate this Tyon. Why are you after him? Right, I have to tell you about what happened. Would you like the short or the long version? Summarize it. I wasn't always a mercenary, I used to be an Arbuck soldier and that Tyon was working under me. Brought him into my family, then he became affectionate towards my daughter, but she wasn't feeling the same way, so his actions started to irritate her. I had no choice but to intervene. I couldn't figure out how... Couldn't figure out how worse Tyon would get back then. Would get back then, okay. He believed that me and my wife were preventing him from my daughter. He thought getting rid of us would solve all the problems. Wow, he's crazy! He hired a gang that goes by the name of the Zosins. One evening, they came to our house, shot me and my wife, kidnapped my daughter. My wife didn't survive, but I did. Well, obviously. Once I pulled myself together, I started tracking Tyon. I've been tracking him since then. I killed all the members of the Zosin gang one by one, but I couldn't locate him. Got Wazzle for this job, whom you already met. He found Tyon's location and sent me the coordinate box with you. Uh, you already know the rest. Is your daughter alive? I really don't know. If my daughter is alive, I'll just kill Tyon, but if anything happened to her, you wouldn't want to hear what I'll do to Tyon. Actually, I'm fine with that. We can hurt Tyon in a different way. He has a very good friend, Commander Nana. We're gonna go kill someone's Nana? She never stopped supporting Tyon. Right now, she is in the solar system on the glacier planet of Saburn, commanding a military base. Oh, okay. A military commander? I mean, she's supporting a douche nozzle, but she's still in the military. Right, that's not an option. That place where Nana is like a castle. You go there straight forward, the long range turrets will take you down in no time. We need to be silent and invisible. Send a drone to the planet and move with stealth, our chances would be greater. But we have a little problem. Drones cannot crack open the gate of the building where Dana is. Do you have a solution? Yes, but I need a solid protection. Nana's building is powered by four generators. If I can destroy these generators, Nana's building will be defenseless. Then I could go and take her down, but you need to protect me from coming space attacks at space. Okay, give me the location of the planet. I'll protect you when you take her down. 
Cool. That sounds awesome. I've uploaded the planet's location to your scanner. Go to Planet Suburn's landing platform and wait for me there. Be careful up there. They have quite powerful atmosphere defender systems. Also remember, everyone I kill down there and everyone you kill up there has already deserved what's coming. I don't know that that's exactly true. You're talking about attacking a military installation and a military commander, might I add, for your revenge. Hey. The commander might be aiding Tyon, but the normal troops? They... they don't have much of a say. They follow orders. Okay, so... Uh... That's not as good. Not as good. Not as good. Wait, where was the purple thing I got? Oh, it's a rocket! Yeah, that's badass. We're putting that in there. Uh, the Thor laser is not... It cools down, but it has a much wider range. And it uses more energy. I don't I don't like the that quick cooldown. Turret ignition T4. Turret ignition stabilizer. So I'm going to hit a lot more accurately, huh? Okay, so I got a turret booster that does damage. I can't put it in because I don't have a very rare ship. That's annoying. Uh, increase ship's energy by 12%. We're actually going to sell all this stuff now. The, the different rockets, the different turrets. That I don't want to sell, so don't let me, damn it. I need to save it for a rare ship. I've got the Andromeda, which on my to-do list is to buy something better. Yeah. I just need 890,000. But let's go sell some stuff and uh, we'll look at this mission. I'm going to need to gain some levels. But we did a lot. We actually did something for someone. We did something for Anka. I'm going to go out and I can see if I can find an anomaly so you guys can understand kind of what I mean by it. It's, it's actually really cool because you start going inside looking for the core. And then you always get jumped by pirates. Always. Uh, burn wire. Let's make some money, too. Energy module. Rank, I didn't need that. Now, see, it says can be used in crafting, but I have not been introduced to crafting yet. Once I am, I'll probably be keeping this stuff. Nickel or gold. Oh my god, I might... I might be able to buy some really nice stuff. Ah, oh, yeah, there's the white core, 13,549. Insufficient capacitor? Oh, no! I can't do my armor upgrade. I need 40 on the capacitor. What am I at? Ah, uh, <laughs> three short! Come on! I, I could get, like, a capacitor booster instead of this energy booster. But I like the energy because that's what you need to fire lasers. That's what you need to repair shields. Oh, it's in the system. I didn't think it would be. Tier 2 space anomaly and tier 2 debris. Um, tier 2 makes it sound like it's going to be... Uh, a bit more difficulty with the pirate ships that jump me. Um, it's always been tier one so far. Greetings. I'm commissioned by Arbuck Commander Allen. He wants to talk to you about something very important. He'll be waiting for you in the living quarters. Okay, that's new. So I have to go to Core City. Now I heard it. I'm hearing it, but... Enemy detected. Oh, there it is. Let's see if I can get it real quick. It's just ships. It's not those little, like, fleas that come after you. It's just regular ships. Come on, get, get it for me. That said, I need to be... Ouch. 
a fire core. I need to be out here for these guys because, as you can tell, kind of hairy here. Yeah, the um, flying conditions are not optimal. And yes, for those who know how good I am at games, I have flown into the walls and killed myself. Hey, somebody was wondering, like, you see how well I shoot in Resident Evil? Although in my defense, I am shooting much better in this game than in Resident Evil, so... Okay, so I don't see anybody here. So you hit B, you come to freelance contracts, and you can scan for them. And it pops up all these different ones. Now, when I first saw these, you know, it's not the system I'm in, I started freaking out. And when I went to do my first mission, I saw how easy it was to jump around and went, Oh, that's cool! But the levels can be all over the place. Uh, the pirate ones are the ones I've been doing, which you lose some faction standing if you do piracy. But that's where I got the easiest level missions. Now the freelance contracts, you don't lose standing, you just gain money. Not as much fun as being a pirate. And then you scan for the trade ones. I don't have any right now. That's fine. Oh, okay. Experience. Oh, experience points. No, that's a bonus for five. I thought it said gathered as in, you know, when you're actually out there gathering stuff. Okay, salvage. Drone. So I'm gonna have to do this outside the ship. But as you can see, it starts like dematerializing parts, and that's how you get your different... I got a trigger unit. Network cargo. I don't know what that stuff is. It's... Like, it's coming in here. But yeah. Pod with a dead body inside. Eh? Yeah, it's, it's used in... A lot of this stuff is used in making um, ships, but they haven't, or, or even weapons, but they haven't taught me how to craft. Grow and get to work. So I'm gonna go get this whole field now. So aside from some really tiny ones, I've gotten all of this. And as you can see, I've gotten a ton of stuff. Um, 903 out of a thousand. I'm surprised I did not get attacked, honestly. But we're gonna go land, we're gonna go sell some stuff, and we're going to call that good for this one. I wish I could do some crafting. They haven't really showed me how, and I haven't, like, taken the time to look it up. But a lot of this is damage beyond repair. But there you go, use fuel tank. Can be used in crafting. How? Can I turn it into missiles? What? Um, can be used in manufacturing. I, I don't know. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. That's okay. I'll learn. It's it's a really fun game. There are some things about it, like the, the bounty difficulties. And then I had another mission that I went and did, and it said I, it was a mission for my level. And I got my ass kicked so fucking bad by this capital ship. I had to reload the game because I couldn't actually run away from the battle. It wasn't letting me, like, disengage. Like, I was, you know, 140 kilometers away from it. Way outside of any kind of range. And it wouldn't let me disengage and run. I, like, literally ran from where I was across the system to the jump gate and it just would not let me warp so there there's some things about it that are a little uh but 
it's not that big a deal. It's really fun. The, the music's amazing. Wow. If I wasn't trying to save it for when I get a rare ship, selling that would help me get a rare ship. So I don't have room for that unless I get a bigger capacitor. I don't know if I want to sell it, though. I mean, look, sell that one, that one. I've almost got a rear ship. Instead, I'm selling cheese shit salvage. Pods with dead bodies in it at 356 a pop. Well, yeah, sell them all. I don't want any corpses on my ship. I have 121,000. So if I sold those two off, I would be like 450,000 and halfway to the missile ship, which once I got the missile ship, I could put all those rare ones on it. <sighs> oh well. Oh well. We will get there. We will definitely get there. What level am I? Level 11. I didn't get any new... No, I didn't. Anyway, I'll continue playing this in my spare time whenever I have a chance. I'll continue leveling up. I'll probably revisit it. It seems like every time I play this, there's something new that I go, Oh, that's cool, because the space anomalies I did for the first time when I was leveling up. I was like, these are really cool. Same thing with the wreckage, like the, the shipwrecks. Very first time seeing that when I played leveling up last time, so... Man, I wish I need to put some of this stuff in my storage. Anyway, leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell so you can see whenever I upload new videos. Links in the description for Facebook, Twitter, and the game. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Catch you all in the next one. Bye!